Hello viewers, welcome back. Now today we are back in our jungle factory location again. This beautiful factory location that we have been here before. Why is that? Because we are going to guide you to explore our beautiful container farming system. Now today this is going to be something different. I will show you in a little while. First of all, uh, let's review what we have said before that this is a 10 key project, which means when you get a container, that you just need to connect the water source and the power source at the back of the container, then uh, you will have a cover like this. The back cover will protect it with um, stainless uh, steel panel. So this is just uh, showing you the basic structure for the water and the power connection. Okay, now let's move to the front of the container and explore our container farming system today. Okay, let's go. So, as we mentioned before, that this is a um, 40 feet high Q uh, size of container and it will be insulated by our company. We will have the insulation laying inside, then we have the stainless steel uh, cover on the outside of the door. And let's go inside, we have something beautiful, very eye-pleasing to show you today. Our beautiful, fresh and vibrant uh, baby plants that we have been planting for about five days now. So uh, let's move forward and um, as we mentioned, yeah, this is an um, insulating door and the whole container, the inside of the whole container are insulated. So you have the energy well locked inside of this system that you don't waste any money. Okay, this is the operation room. So when you walk in, it's about um, 1.4 meter, uh, the, the depth is about 1.4 meter, which is about five feet. And so within this space, you can have a lot of potential. You can have a lot of things integrated in this a small space as for oper operation room. So first of all, we have this very, um, you know, customized, beautiful, uh, integrated system for the uh, control system for climate control, irrigation and fertigation. And as well as the distribution cabinet in or well um, installed inside and you can have some space down below which you can you know uh, transform into some uh, storage space or uh, for, like for seedling or other functions and here we have a space to help you store two large uh, CO2 tanks okay this is a very integrated customized um, very sleek and beautiful system that you have right here for controlling uh, the main functions in this container farming system. And over here we have a counter space and a sink for you to do some cleaning and operating and also more storage area down below which you, <coughs> which you can like uh, store the uh, clean garment or uh, other type of things, uh, your tools and other materials. So a lot of um, storage space for you and up here you can see we still have a lot of space that you can customize uh, to fit your, uh, to meet your demand, fit your need. Okay, this is our uh, operation room. So uh, right before we are about to enter into the operation room, we have an air curtain here. So with the cool air, the blowing down, we are locking the energy, the um, uh, cool air and the humidity and inside of the planting area. So we have this uh, air curtain to help you lock the, the uh, energy inside. So you are not wasting any of the cool air or anything from the planting area. Okay, let's move forward a little bit more. And oh yeah, by the way, we want to mention the operation system a little bit. So. We have everything integrated in this one system and what you can see here is just a very neat a screen for you to see um, the main um, parameters and the factors when you are operating and monitoring uh, this container farming system. So we have all the basics as for, for example, now we have this um, irrigation system shown on the screen. You have the EC, pH, temperature and water level everything uh, well displayed on the screen and you can even see um, like how many rows of uh, shelvings are being watered 
uh, when the system is running, you will see like um, how many rows are being watered for the moment. So we have a kind of rotation system uh, in here. So we don't need a huge size of uh, a water tank that saves a lot of space. But on the meantime, you still can do the irrigation in the rotation way. So if you have all the plants well watered uh, within this small space with a limited um, size of the water tank. Okay, and then you can also see the uh, historical line chart for all the important factors, like for the temperature and humidity, CO2, and so on. Okay, for this is for irrigation, and uh, when everything are well set up, you will also be able to see uh, things for the climate control. Okay, so this is a prototype to uh, for you to see right here just by operating on this screen and besides that you will also be able to access us uh, access um, you know you know to operate and monitor the system have access to the system through our ProLeaf app okay this is um, everything integrated in one system for the climate control irrigation uh, for this system okay now and as you can see we have a slide board here so it's very neat design for this space. So everything well protected and locked inside. Okay, move forward. We have a camera, which you can monitor everything remotely uh, through this camera. And if you uh, want to like include other functions like fire alarm or, or anything like that, we are also able to customize that part for you. But the standard size uh, it's just with our remote camera because um, that's the fundamental uh, function that most users will need. And over here we have a system for monitoring monitoring the nutri nutrient part. Uh, it's a kind of um, system for our fertigation uh, controlling. And over here you will be able to see <laughs> eight pumps. So we have eight pumps here. So usually you can have like um, like four pumps as one set uh, to do uh, the fertigation for one, one type of plant. And for, with eight pumps, you'll be able to um, do the uh, fertigation for two types of plants. And even more for some of our uh, growers, they can use this eight pumps to do the uh, fertigation for four types of plants. So that means within this one system, you will be able to plant up to like four types of different plants or herbs or vegetables. Okay, so uh, we have like a lot of potential here with these um, numbers of pumps right here. And um, as you can see down below, we have the area for storing the nutrient buckets and we have a pump down below, which uh, help you to connect to the water tank. So you can see the water tank is very well placed and designed down below. So it's not taking up, uh, taking any extra space, but it's um, still very neat with a large size. So with this amount of water, you will be able to water, uh, irrigate all the plants with no problem. Okay. So if you are using uh, the system to plant like more than two types of plants, then we can also customize and adjust uh, the um, you know the setting and the design for the water tank so so you will be able to have like two or four different um, uh, sections of tank to help you do the irrigation okay that's about the irrigation system so um, regarding the irrigation system we are using the NFT ebb and flow system through the whole container so all the nutrient water are well utilized and well recycled so it's a very sustainable and efficient way that you can work with the irrigation. Okay, for the down, you can see these beautiful, fresh baby plants, um, that they're lettuce. So, and here you can see, we have like five um, layers uh, in one shelf, like five layers and all the way down, we have like eight vertical rows, and with the two rows on down the container, we have like um, so this part we have um, 
five layers and eight vertical rows and plus this side with two two rows all combined we can plant up to um, 2200 um, plants which are for the big plants like a kale and um, spinach um, this and like this larger size um, vegetables but if you are using our other type of tray with um, 50 planting holes on each tray, then you will be able to plant up to 4,000 heads of plants in this one system. So for this particular one, uh, uh, twin, uh, they are about twin, they are 28 uh, planting holes inside. We have another version which is with uh, 50 planting holes for one tray. So um, 4,000 plants in one system, and that's a great amount. Um, very promising harvest that you will be able to get. So then let's talk about the important parts, important facts, um, including, uh, you know, regarding the climate control. Okay, we can check out the CO2 uh, enhancement first. So as you can see, these white tubes, uh, that's us installed all the way down uh, in this container. And we have these sprayers, uh, CO2 sprayers, like you know, are placed um, within with a certain distance, of, you know, b between each of the sprayer. So the CO2 will be released from the CO2 tank and be like lead all the way through the container and be sprayed out from the sprayer heads. So all the plants will be get the will be getting the even amount of CO2 uh, to help them grow. So very evenly placed, uh, the sprayer will help the plant to be well um, nurtured with this kind of air-based nutrient of CO2, okay? And then let's check out the air conditioning part. Yeah, so in the, this container system, we have the HVAC system at the back of the container, and we have the air with the, will create the proper humidity and temperature blowing out from the HVAC system and the air breeze will be guiding through these tubes, these kind of tubes and we have an outlet right next to each of the tray. As you can see, uh, right next to each tray we have the outlet to lead the breeze from the HVAC system to be blowing on these beautiful plants and to help them uh, grow in the best way with this uh, very even um, dispersed air and very well controlled climate system. So that's uh, the part for the uh, humidity and temperature which are controlled through our HVAC system and with the breeze um, led to right next to each of the tray. Okay, and that's for the uh, temperature and humidity. Then we can check out the lighting part. So we have all this, oh, we have all this special lighting for um, planting vegetables. So these lighting is able to help you plant basically most types of uh, vegetables, uh, plants, or, or herbs or uh, fruits in the market. So these are the special lightings that we have set right above each planting tray with the size of, you know, very nicely fit into the shelving and covers the planting tray area um, very nicely. So all the plants are getting the proper amount of lighting here. Okay, so, and you can check out the whole um, setting in this container and we have everything well organized, very easy for you to work on the trays, the plants, and it's a very clean and neat system. You have everything you need right here, and you can even uh, like remotely moni monitor the, the, the planting site, and if um, the plants are growing very nicely through our remote camera, like on your phone, on your laptop, then you will be have very uh, real-time access to the whole system even when you are not in this uh, planting location, not in this container farming system. Okay, so as you can see, we have everything uh, very well organized and if you have other 
like request or demands or the functions that you want to achieve, we can still have a lot of space and um, uh, you know setting that you can add those functions that you want in here. Okay, so hope you enjoy the system. I think it's very beautiful, very eye pleasing. So that's why we like um, show you again today and help you to explore the system a little bit more. If you have any questions, uh, do not hesitate to ask us. You can leave us comments and we will answer them. And if you want more information on this system, we will send those information to you. And uh, like we can answer if you can customize uh, certain things or uh, if there are other potential for this system. Okay, so let's keep in touch and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.